I can't even speak English today. Hey guys, it's Jay, and today I'm here with another unhaul video. I have a total of 10 books that I'm going to be sending back to my local thrift store because I either don't have shelf space or I just really didn't enjoy the book or I already have a copy of the book, so no point having two. So without further ado, let us get started. Wow. So the first book that I have is one that I made a rant review of because I absolutely hated the book, so I just need it to get out of my life, but it is Hexed by Michelle Chris. If you're interested to see me get exceptionally angry while reviewing this book, then go ahead and check out the review. I'll leave it up there as well as down there. The next book I have is one that I'm getting rid of because I didn't really love it, so I don't need it on my shelf, but it is There's Someone Inside Your House by Stephanie Perkins, and this is her like YA horror novel, which she usually writes YA contemporary, so I was interested, but I read it and it was nothing special, so I need more room on my shelf, so it's going back to the thrift store. The next book I have is Local Girl Missing by Claire Douglas, and this is another one that I gave a 3 out of 5 stars. It was okay while I read it, but it was nothing special. It was super predictable, and I was able to call exactly what was going to happen, so I'm never going to reread it, so why keep it? The next one is another one that I gave 3 out of 5 stars. It was okay while I read it, but I have no reason for it to be on my shelf when I have, like, no shelf room. It is... The Girls by Emma Klein. I wanted more from this book. It was supposed to be like a cult book and it was mostly about a girl who obsessed over one of the cult members, but I just wanted to know more about the cult, but I didn't get it, so I don't need it. The next book is Say Her Name by Juno Dawson and it was supposed to be a horror novel and it was not scary at all, so I just, I don't care about it and I don't need it. So back to the thrift store. The next four books are actually duplicates and I also just gave them three out of five stars so I feel like I don't need them on my shelves. All four of them are graphic novels. The first two are All Summer Long by Hope Larson. Gave it a three out of five. It was cute but I don't want it. And then the second group that I have is called Be Prepared. One's an art copy and then one's like the final copy and again it was cute but I don't need them on my shelves because I only gave them a three out of five. And then the final book that I have is because I was sent two copies by accident, but it is The Outcast by Taran Mathru. I gave this book a four. 0.5 or a 4 out of 5. Definitely recommend reading the Summer Nerd trilogy. This is like the prequel to that trilogy. I have a review of it if you're interested, but 100% great series. Definitely read it. The only reason I'm getting rid of it is because I already have a copy of it. All right, guys, so that was my unhaul video for this month. Let me know down below if you've read any of these and what you thought of them, and I'll see you all in my next video. Goodbye!